Hello everyone, welcome back. In this session, we will learn how to solve the practice problem third largest element. So let's understand the question first. Basically, in this question, we are given an array. Like let's say, okay, this is the given array, and we need to print the third largest value element. So what I can do is first I can sort this array, right? It would be very easy for me if this array is sorted. So if I sort it, it would be one, two, three, five, and 10, right after sorting the array i need to print the element with third largest value okay so what i can do is why not i start the index positioning from this side okay so basically the index positioning from the right side is minus 1 minus 2 minus 3 minus 4 and minus 5 now it it is very clear right that the element at minus 1 would have the highest value the element at minus 2 would have the second highest value and the element at minus 3 would have the third highest value, right? So that is what I want, right? So basically first sort the array. Then you can, you know, use negative indexes to solve the problem. I hope the concept is clear to you. Now let's solve the question. What you need to do is you need to go to the practice portal. In practice portal in the difficulty section, choose basic, okay? Then you need to find the problem third largest element. Once you find the problem, you need to click on solve. Okay, so let's solve the problem. Okay, here is the problem. Let's read the question first. Given an array of distinct elements, find the third largest element in it. Suppose you have this array, its output would be 5 because it is the third largest element in the array. Okay, and we need to code it over here. Okay, so let's code it. So, like I mentioned, first step is sorting the array, right? So, it would be a dot sort. Okay. Next is I just need to return with the index position minus 1. So it was not minus 1, minus 3. Okay. Now I need to check if the solution is correct or not. So I would click on compile and run. Let's wait. Compilation is completed. My output is matching with the expected output. So now I would submit the given problem. Okay. Problem is solved successfully, and this is how you solve the practice problem third largest element. I hope this video was helpful for you and you guys enjoyed it. If you have liked the video, make sure you click on the like button and thank you for joining me today. Thank you.